Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. We live and we back, man. NFL Week 9, talking running backs. We're going to jump right into it. But before we do, man, if you're new to the channel, I'm your host, Chandler Blakely, a.k.a. Goose, man. Over here at Golden Goose DFS channel, man, we do single entry 3 max and 20 max, all right? That's what we talk from. That's the majority of our play. So if you're interested in doing that, man, hearing about those type contests, hit the subscribe button. Definitely hit the like button for tuning in. And turn your notification bells on, man, so you can be here rocking with us every day when the video drops, all right? Listen, man, if you saw my stacks video, you see the thumbnail, you should already know. If you didn't see my stacks video, go check it out right now, man. Um, I'm running back. I'm opening up with Austin Eckler, 8,800. Not really worrying about this questionable tag. Fully expect him to play. Uh, it was limited in practice the other day. They're missing all those receiving options over there. But they're still projected. Vegas still has them scoring 26 points, man. One of the higher team totals on the slate. And if they're scoring 26 points, I think at least two of those touchdowns, Eckler. Uh, Eckler's going to get at least two of those touchdowns, man. They score 26 points. Just in my opinion, especially missing all those receiving options out there. I think he's a must play for me, man. Hoping the ownership is a little lower on him, especially because he's one of the higher priced running backs on the slate. Uh, the highest priced running back on the slate, to be exact. But. I like getting to him right here, paying up at running back. It's a lot of pay down options, so hopefully paying up at the top, his ownership is down, helps me get a little different. But I'm expecting another big performance from Eckler right here in this spot, all right? Another running back, man. I, I think we can go back to Josh Jacobs. I'm I'm hoping the ownership is down. I'm hoping because people uh got burned by him last week. He failed you in that spot. But you can look at it one of two ways. You can look at it like they got crushed just because they didn't look good or they got crushed because they didn't get Josh Jacobs the ball enough, man. He was seeing 30-plus touches in prior games. I don't know if they wanted to give him a rest this game or whatever the case may be, though. I expect him to get back to featuring Josh Jacobs heavy in this contest, especially with questionable spots over there on their offense. So I like going back to Josh Jacobs at 7,300 right here. Should be a little ch chalky, but I'm, I'm hopefully not – too too chalky as you know running backs don't get too chalky uh especially when you have a, a as many playable running backs as we have on this sunday slate it's at least about eight to nine solid running back options so i don't expect anybody to get too chalky but probably the highest chalk guy my third running back but i'm okay getting to him is travis Etienne, man we saw him flashing when James Robinson was back there with him. They finally shipped James Robinson out. It is his backfield. All the touches, he's the pass catching back. So no matter the game script, he should be involved. I expect him to get a lot of touches here. 6,300, great price on him. Like the matchup against the Raiders. He should be a little chalky, but I'm okay getting to the chalk right here, man. I like getting the Travis ETN right here. Now, for your GPP plays, man. Everybody is going to Aaron Jones. I don't like it. I don't like it, man. You can go to A.J. Dillon in your GPPs, man. I really don't like Aaron Jones. I think I don't mind going back to Dalvin Cook right here as a pivot from Aaron Jones chalk, man. He's looking like he's getting highly on, but I do not mind going to Dalvin Cook. I'm not afraid of this commander's defense. He's another guy that's going to be heavily involved in his offense for the Vikings. You know it, so it doesn't matter the game script. If they got to pass it to him, they will. Screens, touches, he's going to get it all, man. 20 to 25 touches, hopefully, in his future right here, and he definitely a, a threat to put it in the end zone. So I like getting to Dalvin Cook as well, man. All right? There you have it, your running back this week nine, man. Dalvin Alvin Cook, Josh Jacobs, Austin Eckler, and Travis Etienne Jr., man. Get you some exposure to these guys. Get them in your player pool. You know they're going to be in mind, all right? That's going to do it for us here today, man. Check out the other videos. If you play basketball, I've got plenty of DFS hoop content for you, man. Hit the like button on your way out the door. Y'all know the motto. Chances make champions. Y'all green up, man. I'll catch y'all next time, all right? Let's get it.